Hi guys, in today's tutorial we build a shop system in Minecraft. Pause to read. Enjoy the tutorial. To start off you want to place all the blocks in a formation like this. Then break this block and then place your dropper one block lower. Now place a temporary block here. Then break this temporary block. Add some water here so the items can flow up to the player. Now place for carpet like this. Now place blocks like this. Next place three hoppers and two temporary blocks. Now, remove both temporary blocks and place a chest. Also, remove these two blocks so you can access your chest. Now as we come to the front, place blocks like this to finish the frame of your shop. Now place your stone wall on the side of this block. Now, place your signs like this if you chose to use them. Place four blocks on the back of the second hopper down three blocks out. Then place a comparator and three redstone like this. If you have done it correctly, you will end up having the comparator reading the first hopper we placed. I recommend you pause here to make sure you've done it correctly. If you have, you should have a comparator on the first block and three redstone on the others. Now place the blocks how I do. Oops. Now place a redstone repeater and a redstone torch how I do. Now place a temporary block here and a sticky piston on the side of it, make sure the sticky piston is facing down. Now place an observer with its mouth facing towards you. Now place blocks exactly how I do. Now come back to the first block you placed and run a redstone line down. Then place a redstone repeater on this block. Mistake here, you do not need a target block here, you can just place a normal block, instead it works the exact same. Place a block after you've placed a normal block and put a comparator on it. Make sure the comparator is facing into a block with redstone on it. Now you want to place a sticky piston like this. This next part is harder to explain, but I'll try my best. You want to place an observer facing into the sticky piston, you should be able to see its head on the other side. Place a block on its face and then place another observer facing its mouth towards you. Make sure you break the block in between them. Now place a block after the last observer with redstone on it. Then on this block, place a redstone torch with a block above it. For the stock light, it's really simple. Just watch what I do. Make sure the comparator is facing into the block and not the dropper. Now you can put whatever. Nearly done. Now, to make this work, we need to use 2 to 3 of our currency and also 44 useless named stackable items. I will be teaching you how to do this with 60 for rotten flesh for example. You first need to name it something that a player wouldn't name a useless item. Now follow how I do this. Split the useless items until you have 4 of 11. Now I'll show you how to finish off your redstone shop. Open the first hopper and put your items in like this, with your payment item being in the first slot. Now you are complete, let's test it. The player simply puts their crossbar on the wall and then throws the diamond at it to purchase. That's it for today's tutorial. I hope you all enjoyed it. See ya in the next one. Bye.